Generation wealth? This has become so overused, but what does it even mean? Can I ask you a question? Which one do you want me to invest in for you, Disney or Netflix? How can people who didn't come from generational wealth get there? In today's episode, I'm first going to address what generational wealth actually means. Then I'm going to show you how to easily build financial security for your family with any asset class, regardless of your income level or education. The best way to build generational wealth is to start early. That's why I have this big goal to help 1 million households take control of their financial future, join the Investiva movement by checking out my free masterclass below and share it with your friends to help us crush that goal. Everyone and their mother is throwing out the phrase generational wealth on social media these days. And rightfully, many of you are bothered by this term being overused. At Investiva, we have a very specific definition of generational wealth. We are cycle breakers, people who didn't come from money, who are on their way to not only create financial independence for themselves, but put their money into work so their wealth multiplies for the generations to come. Building generational wealth can help you provide a legacy for you and your family. There are many ways to do this, but they all boil down to this one secret. Are you ready? It's called compounding. Let's look at this in practice. First up is compound interest aka the eighth wonder. It's like your money's own magical growth potion. You get there by starting investing early and strategically. Consider setting up a Roth IRA for your newborn or diving into real estate in a red hot market. Once you've maxed that out, create a traditional brokerage account and keep on investing. Small gains might not seem like much, but these can grow significantly over time. That's why Albert Einstein once called compound interest the eighth wonder of the world. Number two, compound knowledge. Keep feeding that brain. Think of your brain as a supercharged financial sponge. Always keep soaking up knowledge and upgrading yourself, learning high income paying skills that are not taught in universities. Get in the room with entrepreneurs and wealth creators. Create an online business, which is now easier than ever, especially when you use AI. Buy boring businesses like laundromats and storages, dive into real estate know-how, and stay ahead of those tax rules like a pro by using multi-level trust funds that Rockefellers use. Number three, compound habits. Money moves like a boss. Habits are your secret weapon on the road to financial independence. Think staying in abundance mindset, Pro tip, I made a whole video on that. Seeing challenges as opportunities, living below your means, and making your money have babies every single month. But wait, there's more. You gotta pass these habits down the line. Start them young by giving your kids some cash every time they tackle a household chore. It's like teaching financial responsibility with a sprinkle of chores. Here's a sneaky secret not everybody's talking about it. That's the transfer of knowledge. Yep, it's like the secret sauce in keeping the generational wealth machine churning. Talk about investing and let your kids pick their own stocks. My five-year is already getting to the habit of investing and entrepreneurship instead of consuming. We often play shop with real money, and even if she barely understands it, I ask her which company she wants me to invest in for her. So can I ask you a question? Which one do you want me to invest in for you, Disney or Netflix? Netflix. Netflix. We actually, well right now she's camera shy, we actually have in-depth conversations about it. You want to do it one more time? Did you get camera shy? It's cute, it's fine. By teaching your family the ABCs of financial literacy and the magic of compounding, you're not just passing on the money, you're passing on the wisdom, the values, and the habits that'll stand the test of time. You're also preventing them from choosing the wrong partners who can't communicate about money and wealth. Remember, wealth isn't just dollars, it's the whole enchilada knowledge, values, and habits. So make it your mission to create a culture of financial empowerment within your family. So are you ready to become a generational wealth ninja no matter your income or asset class? It all starts with compounding, my fellow Investivas and Divos. Don't forget to check out my free masterclass in the description below. Let's rewrite your financial legacy together. I love you. <laughs>
how do you want Disney or Netflix, okay? Which videos do you like? Do you like Disneyland or do you like Netflix? Which one do you like? So when I ask you, you know what to say, okay? Mm -hmm. All right, all right.